G'day everyone, uh, welcome back to Red Trucks, my name is Jim. Um, in this video I'll be doing an unboxing from um, a new friend I've made. Uh, his name is Robin, he's in Canada, I believe it's Nova Scotia. Uh, I met Robin um, on YouTube about seven weeks ago. Uh, I met him through Todd at uh, Mountain 66 Diecast. Uh, when I first started my channel, uh, Todd and Robin uh, and Zoid's Toy Cars and Zelda Racing were my first subscribers. I think Robin was number two or three. Um, so yeah, we've, we've been conversing online on, on YouTube um, through emails. Um, he's a really, really cool dude, I guess you call him. <laughs> uh, yeah, so he, he does some really good uh, stop motion videos, uh, racing videos, uh, customization videos. So have a look at his channel, um, give him some diecast love, um, check it out. <clears throat> so that's his logo, so it's uh, Rip Wreck Racing. And so yeah, so... Um, so how the story started was he he told me he um, really liked um, my channel and how I how I spoke and he he felt the need to make me a um, a handcrafted um, fire truck. Um, I'm not sure what it's made out of actually. I I, I believe it's uh, it might be plastic. I'm not sure. We'll find out soon anyway. Um, yeah, he calls it f folk art. Uh, fire truck. So so let's open it up and have a look. <coughs> oh, I've actually had this package for a couple of weeks now. I've just been waiting for the right time to open it. And today's the day. That's the top. Ah, you got some nice little wooden hand painted pictures. Thanks, Robin. <coughs> Excuse me, I uh, just grabbed the other one out. Okay, it's a different shape and uh, slightly different colors. 2022. Ah, nice little mementos. Thanks, mate. I think that's all. Just check. I don't miss anything out. Yep. <coughs> okay. Get rid of the box. And let's have a look. I want to be very careful with this. Um, opening this up. Because uh, it could be quite um, fragile. Because it's not made of um, metal. All right, the big unveiling. Unveiling, I mean. <laughs> oh, a little bit more tape to cut. Okay, wow. So this is... Check out his video. He actually did a video about the whole process of um, making this step by step. So I, I saw the video. It started out like as a white block or something. And he hand carved it, which was quite amazing. So check out the video. So that's his logo again, Rip Wreck Racing. So have a look at his channel, give him some support. Because he supported me right from the start and I really appreciate it. Thank you, mate. 
<coughs> right, here's the model. Just blow the <laughs> bit of debris off it. Want it to look as good as possible. It's got a logo on it, little lights. It's got Julie's on the back. I love Julie's. It's a say on the bottom. Okay, maybe I shouldn't show his surname. <laughs> Jim's fire truck. Oh, very nice, Robin. This is so special, you know. It's, it's the only one in the whole world. The only one in, in existence. So, and I've got it. And Robin made it for me, which makes it so much more special. So the amount of hours he put into making this is just amazing. Not sure what make of truck it's based on. Uh, Robin, when you watch this, can you let me know? It's got a couple of sections of um, hoses. <coughs> Excuse me, even the rear window has been detailed. I think this came all the way from Canada to Australia and it made it in one piece so that's fantastic love it very unique So this will take pride of place in my collection. Yeah, Robin, when you watch this, let me know what the material is that you made it out of. A couple of little doors highlighted on the back. Very nice. So great to have it in my hands, finally. So as I said, this is a folk art truck. Uh, I think Robin does a lot of this sort of um, modelling. Great work, mate. Really appreciate it. <clears throat> Excuse me. And plus I got these neat little hand painted pictures. Oops, excuse me. Plus I got this little rounded one. So such a relief to finally have this model, you know. For a while there I was a little bit worried, you know, if it was going to actually arrive. I think Robin was a little bit worried too. <clears throat> so again, thanks from the bottom of my heart, Robin. I uh, really appreciate the work you put into it. Uh, I can't believe someone in Canada actually made this for me. Yeah, he's one of those guys that, you know, supports all the small channels. Always leaves a nice comment for people. So please check out his channel. Uh, Ripwreck Racing. <coughs> yeah, show him some support. Alright, Robin. Thanks, mate. Um... I'm currently getting some cars together to send to you. Um, hopefully I'll, I'll get them away by uh, early next month. Just waiting for um, a delivery or two. So yeah, I'll, I'll let you know uh, when I send them. 
Um, <clears throat> sorry, I still got a bit of a croaky throat. Um, yeah, guys, um, I, I, I don't want to encourage people sending me models because then it's a little bit of trouble for me to go out shopping for car models. I'm, I'm really into fire truck models myself. Um, yeah, at the moment, I'm not really set up to be sending and receiving lots of boxes, so uh, please don't send me any. Um, this was a different manner. Robin actually started making this, um, and and before I could actually say no to it. So, not that I don't appreciate, I do heaps. Like I said, this is going to be very special in my collection. Whenever I look at this, I'm going to think of Robin and you know think what a great guy he was to to make this and send it to me. And yeah, it's just it's fantastic. All right, guys, I'll, I'll wrap up this video. Um, thanks to everyone who watched it. Please check out Ripwreck Racing. Leave leave a comment for Robin on his channel. Give him some support. And. It's Friday here in Australia, so wherever wherever you are in the world, have a great weekend, and I'll see you on my channel next time. Thanks, guys. See you, mate.